Hey YouTuber, so for my next computer build, I purchased a Intel Core i5-9400F desktop processor from Amazon. Um, see how much it is there on the screen. And uh, I had a difficult time with this. I, I wanted to get in the game with the ninth generation and grab a CPU that uh, is not been used a whole bunch if at all really on uh, YouTube um, giving me a chance to uh, make some videos that uh, otherwise would be uh, even more competitive um, for another what 60 70 bucks I could have got the 9600k which uh, you know would have provided better performance single core multi core quad core but uh, I decided to go with this one so we'll see how this works out if I'm not happy with it there's always eBay right folks a lot of my stuff ends up on there and uh, so this this should be decent um, you know I think the the 8400 is the uh, about the 40th ranked CPU uh, so this will be slightly better than that it'll probably actually take over the 40th ranking and uh, I'm hoping that this will help with uh, my processing time for uh, HitFilm Pro and just working uh, with uh, 3ds Max I think uh, those two things should make a difference um, I'm not sure it's going to help too much with my AutoCAD, Autodesk Inventor but then uh, there's also the gaming aspect this should push um, currently I've got a i3-8100 I've been using uh, we also have the i7-8700K at the house uh, which I rarely get to enjoy that one but uh, this one, you know, should become obviously the second fastest processor in the house. Uh, I've got a bunch of other ones there, uh, including Celeron. So I've been able to do 4K gaming on all of those, and I expect this one to, uh, paired with the RX 570 I've got, to crank even better. So uh, stay tuned. I believe from checking out the tracking, I should get this by Friday and not uh, what it says there but uh, I will be putting up a lot of videos in the future about it alright folks so um, then I'll be discussing it reviewing it and basically telling me my thoughts uh, so if you don't know the the F there at the end means that basically Intel has either disabled the uh, UHD 630 graphics or um, for whatever reason those integrated graphics uh, are not there at all and they're supposed to be you know cheaper chips uh, allowing them to be more competitive with AMD uh, right off the bat uh, as you see buying this it's actually uh, more expensive than the 8400 now you get better performance with it but uh, you have to ensure that you have a video card uh, a lot of comments out there that you know possibly your video card will get taxed that much more uh, because you don't have the integrated graphics um, so we'll see if that's true I uh, you know it's kind of questionable when you think about it with the HDMI uh, outputs how that all works um, but we'll see and uh, please uh, tune back in for reviews and discussions. Thank you.